What I'm showing you here is a strategy that is very popular amongst Metal Gear Solid 2 speedrunners, and yes, this works on every single difficulty in the game. The footage you're now seeing is on extreme mode, but go ahead and try it yourself in European Extreme and you'll be able to replicate the same results. First, I'll show you what an ideal fight looks like, basically explain along the way how to go about this. When you begin the boss fight, start by shooting Vamp in the wound on his head with the M9. This actually does a lot of damage if you are precise, but if you miss, that's fine too. A regular headshot isn't optimal, but it will still do decent damage. Don't worry too much if you don't get it just right. Next, Vamp will dive underwater and you must approach the ledge of the pool and make right and hold on to it. The easiest way to do this is to tap the punch button and right and will slip off while safely grabbing hold of the ledge. Vamp will eventually resurface and he will start walking slowly towards right end. When he approaches Raiden, he'll eventually crouch down to swipe at him with his knife. When you see him perform his animation, quickly move back onto the ledge and Raiden will now have invincibility frames during his animation so Vamp's attacks will not hurt you. I explained in my Fat Man video that invincibility frames are frames during a character or enemy's animation where they are invincible and it cannot take damage. This is important because we can exploit this in order to defeat a few bosses in the game and I'm working on that video for you all to explain how to go about that as well. Once you hop back onto the platform, you can now attack Vamp with basic punches. It's important that you slightly delay each punch because we don't want to do a punch combo here. I also suggest that you use a directional pad on your controller because it will help you to realign right and more precisely to hit Vamp the way I'm doing here so that you can remain consistent using this strategy. I know this looks easy, but this can take a lot of practice, so I'm going to now explain what can go wrong and why. First, you can't stray too far away from Vamp. If you do, he will peace out and it will break the loop of the knife animation. Second, you have to find the right sweet spot. You don't want to be too close to Vamp because the attack itself will kill you in one hit if you're playing on European Extreme Mode. It can be tricky, but just keep at it. It is possible to break the loop and reset it, but Vamp's attack patterns depend on how much damage you have already done to him. Do too much damage and he will simply toss knives at you, causing you to lose your grip and fall to your death. As I said, it can take time and be a little frustrating, but just keep trying and don't give up. I believe in you. That's kind of all there is to it. It's very straightforward. Take your time, relax, and you'll become a master in no time. Feel free to also check out my Olga and Fat Man guides. Thank you all for your time. Feel free to like, share, and subscribe, or comment, and now go out and play some Metal Gear Solid 2.